Ready for an extension activity to go along with the book I Am Perfectly Designed by Camaro Brown with Jason Rachel Brown and illustrated by Anusha Side. I've got one for you. Today we are going to be making our family portraits as an extension activity to go along with this read aloud. Um, for materials on what you will need, you will need blank white sheets of paper in order to be our foundation for this project. Um, you will also need different colored sheets of paper. These can be used for the frames in which um, the family portraits will be within. And this is one thing the frame will look like when you first cut them out. You'll need scissors to cut your frames out. You'll need colored pencils to draw any details as well as your family portrait and you will also need glue in order to glue your frame onto the white sheet of paper. So how I started, I started by taking my sheet of colored paper and cutting out a frame. I then went on to decorate the frame as you can see here. Um, I put a little design at the top along the sides and along the bottom. Um, and then I glued my frame onto my piece of paper. I did this so that as I drew my family portrait, I would be guaranteed to make sure my whole family portrait was inside of the frame rather than underneath the sides so everyone could be seen. I then started drawing all the additional details. So I drew this little table that the frame is sitting on as a detail. I, and I drew a little mirror up in the corner. After that, I got started on what's inside of the frame. So I drew both my parents, me and my brother and my sister, and then I also added in some details of some clouds up in the sky. So this picture could have been taken outside. Um, and then once I finished all those details, I decided to write my family portrait along the side. It doesn't have to be right here. It can be wherever there's any free space when you're done. Or if there's no free space, you can put it down here on the table. And then you'd also want to make sure you write who this is by so that you know whose it is when a bunch of these are all mixed together, if they do end up mixed together. So I wrote by Katie P underneath. And that is the completed activity. Thanks, you guys.